Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Health. And we're here to review this plant. This plant has actually been light deprived and most people won't recognize it because it looks so different from what it's supposed to look like. But it's actually a Diphambachia. I'm gonna take a closer look at it. So it turns out that when you put the Diphambachia in a very dark closet, you end up with a growth pattern like this after several months. And as you can see, it's lost all of its leaves, but it's also pretty much lost all of its chlorophyll. So the last little bit of chlorophyll is down here at, at its base. And you, that's the only place you'll find any green on this plant. So very, very different looking plant. So we're gonna leave it in the closet and we're gonna see whether we can see any more changes over time with it. And uh, I'm very, very interested to see how it continues growing. We have another light deprived plant here, and this is what the Diphampachia is supposed to look like. It's supposed to have very large patterned leaves. But if you look in the base of this plant, you'll see that it's white. And the reason why it's white is it was grown under a shelf in the supermarket and it was light deprived. So it lost all of its chlorophyll, not only in its stalks, but also in the veins of the leaf. So if you look at the veins of the leaf, they're actually quite white. So you can particularly see it on this one. So it actually has new growth now. I've actually had this one sitting in a sunny window for several weeks now. And you can actually see that the new growth is actually much greener compared to the old growth and I thought it was a very interesting effect. So let me see whether I can find another leaf that has come up, a relatively new one. And if you look in there, this, this, this leaf right here, it's actually a new leaf. And you can see that it's green compared to the old growth, which is white. So it has a very different growth pattern once it is put back in to sunlight. So the original white growth that is light deprived stays white, but all the new growth coming up goes back to the green growth. And it appears that it can only generate chlorophyll from its new growth, which I thought was quite interesting. So that's where we're up to. So I'm gonna leave this one in the sunlight and we're going to leave the other one in the dark closet and we're going to see what happens. And as soon as I have any more information, I will do another video. I hope you enjoyed the presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.